Arab army units destroy terrorist tunnel in Aleppo, eliminate terrorists in many areas across the country. In cooperation with the Syrian government, a medical shipment offered by the International Committee for Red Cross is sent to Manbij and Al Bab in Aleppo countryside. The German Die Welt newspaper says German intelligence obtains letters sent by German terrorists who returned from Syria, calling for carrying out explosions inside the German territories. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Yerado Kikorian with the news in English. Syrian Arab army units destroyed terrorist tunnel in Aleppo, killed and injured a number of terrorists in many areas in Aleppo. A military source said that Syrian Arab army units killed and injured a number of terrorists in Hanano, Al Marjay, Bab al Nasr, Al Shaf, Al Mansura, the Free Zone, Al Bab, Deir Hafer, and Al Nanani Square in Aleppo countryside. The source added that Syrian Arab army units also destroyed a 100 meters tunnel in Salah al Din area in Aleppo, killing all the terrorists inside it. Terrorists were eliminated, and a car equipped with heavy machine gun was also destroyed in the area surrounding Al Nirab and Al Maysar. A military source said that the Syrian Arab army units thwarted two attempts by terrorists to infiltrate towards the villages of Kafirnan and Ain al-Dananir in Homs countryside. The Syrian Arab army units killed and wounded a number of terrorists and destroyed their criminal tools in the villages of Umrish and Ashindakhiyah in Homs countryside and in al qunaitirat and near the Hussein Mosque in Arrestan. An official source said that terrorists fired three missiles from Al Ghajar village towards Kafirnan. Security forces also clashed with terrorists in Wadi Ahmar, east of Palmyra, killing two terrorists and confiscating their weapons and criminal tools. Security forces also dismantled 19 explosive devices on Baghdad Homs Highway. A military source said that Syrian Arab army units targeted terrorist gatherings and hideouts in the villages of Ad-Durra and Ar-Rawda in Ar-Rabi'a in the northern countryside of Latakia. The Syrian Arab army units eliminated a number of terrorists, among them some leaders of the terrorist groups and non-Syrian terrorists, and destroyed a car loaded with weapons and ammunition. In Hama, a Syrian Arab army unit thwarted terrorist attempt to attack a military checkpoint in Amharde in the northern countryside side of the city, inflicting heavy losses upon the terrorists and destroying an armored vehicle and a car equipped with heavy machine gun. In the resort, a source said that seven citizens were killed and three others were injured of a terrorist car bomb in a Granish town in the eastern countryside of Deir Zor. The civilians of the eastern countryside of Deir Zor confronted an attempt made by the terrorist organization of the so-called Islamic State of Iraq and Asham against the villages of Abu Hamam, Al Jarzi, and Abu Hardub. A source in the governorate mentioned that the citizens managed to reach a Nusur crossing which is located between the two villages of Abu Hardub and Al Jarzi and control it. In Al-Hasaka, a girl was also killed and three other persons were injured by a car bomb in a Jmaya village in Al-Qamishli countryside on Al-Qahtaniya road. In Al-Qamishli, Syrian Arab army units, in cooperation with locals, intercepted attempts made by some terrorist groups to infiltrate into safe areas.
The German Die Welt newspaper said that the German intelligence obtained letters sent by German terrorists who returned from Syria. The letters call for carrying out explosions inside the German territories. A police source said that a terrorist called Silvo ordered the members of his gang to carry out explosions in the city of Essen. The source added that the targets of the terrorist explosions include public places, especially churches and shopping malls. Finally, in order to provide health services for the citizens with the support of the Syrian government, the International Committee of the Red Cross has sent a medical shipment for the people of Membej and al Bab in Aleppo countryside. The shipment includes serum, infection drugs and medical emergency kits sufficient for 150 patients for three months in every hospital. With this, we end our news for today. Thank you for watching. For more details about Syria and the region and to view this bulletin again, you can always visit our website in English, syriaonline.sy. Now to latest business and market news with Nariman Qassam, but after a short break. <laughs>